Hey guys, what's up? Macros X Tutorials123 here. It's been forever since I've made a video, so I thought I'd make one about iOS 4.2 coming out for the iPad. So, um, people, I have heard a lot of stuff about AirPrint not working. So, after doing some research online, I was able to find this thing that was made for the gold map or the beta of Leopard 10.5 or 10.6.5, and it works for. Snow Leopard 10.6.4 as well. What you have to do is, I believe it's called, where is it? It's netcheating.com. Wow. No. You go to AirPrint Hacktivator. I'll put this link in the description. And then you click download the latest version. And it will download it. Once you've downloaded it, you open it up and wow and you click continue even though it says you're not running on 10.6.5 you click continue and then this will be toggled off so wow okay so this will be toggled off and you will click on and then it will ask you for your password to make changes to your system once it's done that you will go into system preferences. It will automatically open up system preferences for you. You will go in here, print and fax. You will delete all of your printers. You will delete them all, so I have two. And you will add them again. So I'll add them again. It will determine its drivers, etc. Add them both. And then, I'm not sure, I printing, sh printer sharing might be off after doing the hacktivation. You, uh, you check that, if you, once you click here in uh, print and fax, you click sharing preferences, you check printer sharing, and then you make sure all the printers that you want to share are checked. And then you can close this, and you can close AirPrint Hacktivator as well. And then, <coughs> The reason you're doing this is because uh, your printer might not be configured to use Wi-Fi sharing natively, so doing this will allow it to. You go onto your iPad, say you want to go into Pages, um, pages, and then you have a document. Um, I'll use this one, it's my homework. And you can go Settings at the top, which is the a uh, little wrench, click print, click printers, it will find your printers and it will tell you that they're shared from your Mac and then you can select whatever printer you want and then you just click print. So I don't know if you can hear it but my printer just started printing and that's pretty much it. Um, iOS 4.2 is pretty awesome, lets you do all the old, like the iPhone stuff for your uh, iPad, like the um, multitasking and folders and all that good stuff. Uh, it also gives you Game Center, which is interesting. Most of the games on iPad don't use it yet, but some of the games who are big time games or from big time companies definitely use it already. Uh, cut the rope. Let's see. Tower Madness HD. Uh, I think Fruit Ninja uses it. I'm not sure. Lots of good stuff. And here's the page that printed straight from my iPad. Looks definitely normal. That. I guess it's first time, one of the first times that something designed by Apple needs to be helped, but oh well. Um, hope you guys wa liked watching this video, and remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll hopefully be making more videos soon. Bye!